Hey, what's going on guys? Well, today's the day that I try bugs for the first time. Ooh, that's right. Real crickets, bacon and cheese flavor, and some larvae. These are Mexican spice, which is just kind of generic. But, yeah. So there you go, some bugs. Let's try them. Got some water here, just to cleanse the palate. Also, I feel like they're going to be dry, so I'm going to be choking on a, a cricket. So let's try these crickets first, right? Here's the ingredients. You can pause there. And the nutritional facts of a cricket. It says here, whole container is 4.3 calories. So that's good. That's in my diet plan. Yay for me. All right, so here's the, the package. Well, let's uh, take our EDC out, which happens to be the Cold Steel Espada. Big thank you to an anonymous viewer. Uh, for sending this. I've never actually owned an Espada, so now I can eventually do a review on it. Gosh, you don't want this. You definitely don't want any crickets. So give me some. Beautiful. This is not for you. Gus really wants some. Go! Uh-uh. You go. Good boy. Crazy dog. Alright, so here's the crickets. And you know, this is, I think, a mind over matter thing. I mean, I'm sure they're going to taste okay. It's not like just grabbing a cricket out of nature and chomping down. These are flavored. We will see. So, let's grab a few out of here. Ugh. Down the hatch. Wow, it is very dry. Let's eat the rest of this little pile of, of bugs here because they're like kind of broken. Here's a full one. It's a full cricket. Hello! <laughs> I guess uh, crickets sound like uh, non-English dudes trying to say hello in a very bad accent. So here we go. All of them at once. Ew. Well, pretty uh, pretty bland. They don't really. They taste slightly of cheese. No bacon. Oh yeah, I guess there's a little faking, faking bacon flavor in there. Save the rest of these for a friend who wants to try them. Let's put those back. Oh, these ones I'm kind of, I mean, that, that skews me out. Crickets, it's like, eh, a spider would be really gross. I don't really like spiders that much. I think it will be really disgusting fleas or um, ticks. Flavored ticks would probably make me puke. But this is definitely sounds grosser of the two. So here's the nutritional facts. Ooh, more calories than larvae. Whole package is 10.1 calories. So if you're dieting, you might want to stick with the crickets. Gus, not for you, bud. Sorry, it is not for you. He's like, he's going around the tripod back and forth. He's like, hey, let me try them. I, you don't want it, I promise. I promise you. All right, so here's what they look like. They're just worms. Disgusting, disgusting. Oop, I don't want to cut them. There we go. All right. Kind of smell good. Ugh. This uh, grosses me out a little more than the other ones for sure. Get a couple there. Eesh. Just what you think, a little worm. Put a whole pile of them here. Well, <laughs> they're not they're not good. These have a nice little kick to them, like just barely a spice in the back of the throat. Um, you know, like the textures, not that good. They're crunchy, but they're like they're very dry. So like it's it's stuck all in the back of my throat. You can't tell, but stuck all over my mouth and my teeth. Um, 
the flavor on this actually tastes a little bit like a good corn tortilla, if that makes sense. Delicious corn tortilla in the weirdest kind of dry texture. If these were bigger, I don't know if you'd want them bigger and juicy, but there's not a lot going on here as far as texture. You know, they're just little itty bitty pieces, so it makes it kind of strange. Yeah, I wouldn't buy, it's a total novelty. You wouldn't pick this over, say, bag of Lay's, you know what I mean? <laughs> You're like, hmm, uh, Fritos, flavored bugs. Eh, no, not really a tough choice there. Total novelty, obviously you'd freak a bunch of people out. You'd have all your friends grossed out and stuff. Uh, you could torture your family with them. These would be great for Halloween. When Halloween time rolls around, every year people posting, you know, weird Halloween, you know, um, snack ideas and stuff like that. Make a regular cupcake and drop some uh, some real bugs on top. That's pretty pretty good for Halloween, in my opinion. But anyway, I have an idea here. My wife made some uh, delicious broccoli soup, which I can't tilt too much, otherwise Gus will get something special <laughs> on his head because he's sitting right there. Um, oh, it's in my pocket. I got a spoon. This is some uh, some bomb ass broccoli soup, healthy and delicious. Mmm. But I'm going to use those bugs as some croutons. Is that gross? Yes, of course it is. But I thought of the idea, and uh, I want to try it. So, let's get some of these, ugh, these worms on there. Ugh, gross. Maybe, uh, let's take some of these solid crickets out, and I'll throw the, the rest of the body parts in there. Ugh. Gross. Put those aside. Oh, my phone on me. I was going to take a picture. I was going to take an Instagram picture. I guess not. Let's, uh, let's see what's going on here. Let me lower this so you can see what's, what's in the bowl. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God is right. How perfect was that timing? That's just some random girl down the street talking about something completely different. How awesome was that? Oh my god. Are those bugs in your soup? Sure are. Alright. Let's try this. Ooh. Friggin' disgusting. I'm hoping they just give it a crunch. A little flavor. I taste them. But the texture is, uh, <clears throat> it's not good. It's like what is good, this soup. So there you go. Sorry guys, you can't even like that clean because there's onions in there. And doggies can't have onions. Sorry buddy. Ugh, it's like all stuck in my teeth. Alright, so. Oh, I got I got a gargle. Well, swish around, I guess. No gargling. <clears throat> so yeah, um, the conclusion. I don't taste like much. The flavoring that's in them is kind of subpar. The Mexican one actually tastes delicious. It's just like really subtle flavor. If I had a bigger punch of flavor, I think they'd be better. But there's not a whole lot there to actually crunch. Even if you have the whole bag in one sitting, it's just like having a half a potato chip. Um, between the two, the texture of the crickets were better just because they were bigger. Um, but the bacon and cheese is just so fake tasting. It's just, ugh, it's kind of gross. And the, um, the Mexican spice flavor was good, just not enough of it. So there you go, there's my uh, conclusion of some eating some bugs. People actually said, a couple people, excuse me, have uh, tried the barbecue ones. They said those are the best. I'm not going to hold my breath waiting for barbecue bugs. Um... But yeah, first experience eating bugs, not so bad. Picking them, you know, outside off the leaves, totally different experience. So it's not really what you think. Uh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> a little, little non-climatic, uh, I guess. Um, 
no puking in this video or freaking out. But uh, I did want to try them, and uh, thank you to the viewer, Andrew, who sent them to me. Appreciate it. Great deal. So there you go. Love trying new things. And I've tried this, I have no more interest. I remember way back in the day, like going on school uh, field trips and getting like the lollipop with the bug inside. You know, it'd be like a spider or a scorpion or something like that. That was kind of gross, but you never really touched it until the lollipop got down to the, the center. And even then, most people throw the lollipop out by that, that point anyway. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a great day. And I'll see you soon. Take care.